guys, how are you? How are you, Derka Friendship? For today's vlog, we're gonna make a uh, pickled papaya. And here is my one large papaya already grated. And and um, I have all my ingredients here. I've got a bell pepper, I've got the carrots. And um, I want my carrots to be like a flowers. I'm an artist, Charot. <laughs> I've got a ginger, and I've got um, a raisins, and I've got an onions. So in order for you to make the um, pickled papaya very yummy, you have to sprinkle two tablespoons salt, two tablespoon of salt on it, and then you have to squeeze it to discard the juice out from that one because the juice is bitter, and so then then let it dry, not let it dry like I put it under under the sunny sunshine, no, not that one. Just squeeze it and take out the juice out of it. And here's on my uh, cooker. There's a mixture of a vinegar. Um, oh my gosh. Um, salt, a sugar, brown sugar. I've got uh, that one is a uh, three cups of vinegar and one cups of brown sugar. Mix it together and let it boil and drop the ginger on it. Just gonna drop the ginger. And here's our raisins, and that's all. And you don't have to boil that much it only boiled like uh, three minutes after the one you take it out it's gonna put our carrots first um, that is not yet three minutes I put the carrots in and I'm gonna put um, like um, five cloves of garlic on it but I have to take it out first I don't want to be overcooked that's like that, something like that. Burn. We're gonna have to let it um let it simmer for like uh, seconds, like fifteen seconds. Whatever you got going, baby, it's burning my eyes. Oh yeah, that's a vinegar though. Mm -hmm. That done the fifteen seconds, and we're gonna take it out quickly and put right in here, and we're gonna have to mix it. And we have to pour it down. We have to pour our bell paper. <coughs> Excuse me. The sour of the vinegar makes me and that, that the onions. And that one is the onions. We're gonna have to mix it. Now take note. Do not get it to overcook because it's not good. It's gonna be mushy. And right after this one, you have to transfer it in the cold container. So it will not continue cooking while you let it cold. It will cold out. Oh, got me my running nose of that. <coughs> this uh, sour thing. Alright, I'm gonna show you after all everything. But right now, I'm gonna have to put this one in the other containers it will cool down Here, honey. properly all right we're gonna start squeezing the juice out of this papaya the grated papaya so here's the papaya that we squeeze out that i squeeze out and there's no juice can you see the texture it's like drying and like before the uh before the juice out of it before i squeeze the juice out it's firm, but this one is like uh, dried. So we're gonna pour the mixture on top of it. There it goes. Mm -hmm. I put a lot of um, raisins because I like raisins. This putting raisins is optional. If you don't like raisins, there you go. You can put like normal also, but I like it. It's really one of the ingredients on it. Now look at the carrots. See, it makes beautiful color on my pickled papaya. And right after you mix it, this, uh, you, have, um, you have to be sure that you, it, uh, it's already incorporated before you put it into the jar. And after you put it in the jar, put it right away in the refrigerator to, to keep it longer. 
this will last like one year if you know how to take care of it all right this is ready you can eat this one now but no preservatives yeah there is there's no preservatives on it just organic i don't know if the papaya is organic <laughs> I found a papaya in America and it's I'm huge enough to make a pickled papaya and here's the finished product. All I have to do is put this in the jar and put it in the refrigerator. I, I have to mix first to incorporate all together. At, uh, but right now, I want to eat this one first. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, share and comment. Thank you. Thank you and have a great day. God bless us all. Bye. So here's the finished product of our uh, pickled papaya. Look how beautiful it is, like me, Charot. <laughs> I know. And it's yummy though. Alright guys, see you on my next vlog. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.